Listen, listen, let's get it out there. Yeah. I've been complimenting like Titi all never... morning because Why? she looks exceptional. And I said, should I use the word I used? No. I, I thought it was Don't a good word. Don't put it out there. The internet never forgets. <laughs> <laughs> you look good today. I love the short thank hair, you. short dark hair, and the dress thank is you, just you. complimenting. Trying something different. Yeah, it's very nice. <laughs> when for you, you look good too. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank what? you. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. We have an interesting story, don't yes, we? Yes, we do. Uh, well, in, in fact, I don't even think it's a story. I think it's something a lot of people have been through before uh, <laughs> when it comes to these online transactions. Oh, yes. Things. I got a story. Um, now, when it comes to online transactions, whether it's POS, whether it's transfer, whether it's, you know, even just going to the ATM machine, sometimes there are these network issues that are so annoying tell me about it yeah but you have an instance before i tell you my, my so, story from um, last now, Sunday. I, 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 so i'm not trying to say you know i know the truth or the, the actual event that occurred yeah in I, this don't, I don't know i don't know in, in this instance who who is yeah, in a sense yeah who yeah. is not well, but there it. are allegations uh against um lizzie and jory mm -hmm. a former uh nollywood actress um, she's still an influencer. She still she apparently sells, you know, jewelry. Did you say and, former? Well, that's that's what uh, most of the blogs are adding. They're adding former. Do you ever leave the? the ad, no. Jahaz, it, has has she? Uh -huh. Well, that's what they're saying online. Uh -huh. I stand to be correct. What's the story, though? Essentially, she was in what seems to be Balogu Market or at least Lagos Island, mm -hmm. some Jankara. area of uh, Lagos Island, purchasing gold or at least golden accessories, mm -hmm. uh, and. Apparently, she made a transfer. Mm -hmm. According to her, she made a transfer, and it had network issues. And as she was walking out, someone ran up to her and said, you know... Accused her. Know, of... Accused her. She, they said fake transfer. Mm -hmm. Fake transfer. So I know that these things do happen. But that loud accusation of fake transfer is mm. such a big deal, especially in a place like... Lagos Island. That's like shouting Ole in 1984. That's exactly. like, that's yeah, like that's... bring tire, bring tire. Exactly. Like it's, it was, I'm just trying to imagine how she, you know, how that scene really mm. went down. There was a video online of a lot of the situation and uh, apparently there was gold found on her. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, who's to say if it is the gold she tried to purchase that was on her? Who's to say whether she, you know, took the gold without... I, I hope that she's absolutely honest in this mm. instance. I hope that it was just a misunderstanding. I hope Because so I have been in instances where you've made transfers mm. and they have reverted without you knowing and yeah. anybody could have just accused me. I'll give you an instance from Sunday. On Sunday, I decided to ride out. It was supposed to be my first ride out for the year. Mm. Didn't go too far in any case, but I had to buy fuel. Mm. I bought fuel of 20,000 naira on my bike. Yes, it does take more than 20,000 naira, <laughs> even if it's a bank. Before somebody would say, ah, boo-boo. No. 20,000 now for the type of bike he rides, <laughs> yes. Yeah. So I had made the purchase ATM, mm. oh, sorry, um, a POS, mm. and I had ridden off. So I stopped to make a call and realized that I got a text message that reverted the 20,000 naira to my account. So it was reversed? It was reversed. Okay. Apparently never went, wow. sort of. Yeah. Or it might have gone and then, I don't know how these things work. You yeah. bankers tell us. So I had to make a 20 minute return back to the fueling 20 station. 20 minutes. And as I was riding into the fueling station, I saw the poor petrol attendant on, on the floor. On the floor like this. <laughs> ah. And when he saw me come, this guy practically ah. worshipped me. Wow. Oh, God, God bless you. Thank you. I don't know what wow. I would have done and everything. Now, wow. that's one of many instances mm -hmm. where I've had these issues mm -hmm. happen to yeah. me. Sometimes I've made. Um, transfers and they've gone multiple times. times. Yeah. Especially at bars, and then you have to go back there and keep drinking because they, <laughs> they don't, they never, they don't respond. They're like, okay, I'll just open a tab for they you. Never no. Yeah, welcome oh, anytime. Wow. You know. I didn't know you visited bars. Oh, trust me, you well. Know, but if it happens in church when you do multiple tithe offerings, it's mm, good. Just a next good, month and next month. The, 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 the critical thing here is what's happening with our with our online banking. Mm, We've been mm. encouraged for the past many years to go cashless. We're finally yeah. going cashless, but it would seem like oh, the apparatus or the system oh, can not accommodate the volume. Of oh, then there is the that. Wow. Exactly. No. Are you trying to say the good bankers have left the country? She yeah, might be right. Most of them. I wouldn't even she like, no, right. I'm not trying to say I am saying, because sometimes, no, speaking of which, sometime last week, I actually strolled into a bank to get an ATM card. And I just, like, the service was just really appalling to mm. me. Because mm. I know normally, generally, Nigerians, we, when it comes to customer service, 
we, zero. We don't mm. have it. Do you understand? What but bank then does again, call them out? <laughs> what color? Is but the then <clears throat> mm. it's a very, very conspicuous color. Oh. So, <laughs> and then again, I mean, stepping in there and seeing the way she's like, I'm literally standing in front of you, smiling and telling, even if I'm not smiling, mm. telling you, okay, fine, I need this and everything and everything, and then you do everything you do and you just drop everything on the on the table. And I'm just looking at her like. Oh. Oh, no, she realized I was just looking. <laughs> like, that's all. And I'm like, okay, okay. where's the card? She now points. I'm okay. like, yeah, a little bit you know, of like how do you, I, so, so it's just like communicates, you understand? Yeah. But then again, on this and during um, situation, yeah. um, I would say, I mean, it's, it's, it's really scary to literally be scary. in the market's place and then literally people yeah, accuse you of, of place, something yeah. that grievous. Mm -hmm. Anything can happen, like zero to 100 real quick. And of course, I'll also say that, I mean, I remember having this conversation with someone talking about how. I mean, Nigeria just makes you automatically paranoid. Because yeah. everybody's thinking, yeah. everybody's trying to literally swindle. like swindle them or literally be smart here and, and there, and definitely doesn't help. Then let's talk about, I mean, internationally, even locally. But then again, I mean, the idea, I mean, there's also situations, being situations of like celebrities going to shoppers to yeah. collect stuff and yeah. not pay for it. So and it but it's different when it's, it's like it's a crazy. boutique. It's different when it's like a shop. This is the market. Mm -hmm. Like, do you have a suicide wish? Nah, wow. <laughs> do you understand what I'm saying? That's part adventure. It is, it's what yeah. it is what yeah, they say. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But um, at, at some point, we're going to have to figure out a way to sort out these transaction issues mm -hmm. because it is so scary yes. what happens. I, we, we heard from one of our uh, producers today that he tried to make a transfer and discovered his whole account was zero zero yeah. mm -hmm. and he didn't understand why it was saying zero it's not as if he spent it but then he checks the ussd mm -hmm. and the money there. the money was there with mm -hmm. ussd but then you in try. his banking app it was saying so, zero so and then something the something is obviously paying. going yeah. on and it is not just uh, restricted to one particular bank yeah. or the other. There must be a system that they are all gatewaying through yeah. that's not working properly at this point. Mm. Is it really? I'm just going to say be careful out there if you're going to yeah. make these transactions. Please just make sure if you're a business owner that yeah. your transactions get to you first before you allow your customers go. Mm. Um, and for anybody who's a consumer trying to get any purchase anything, yeah. <sighs> if you have cash at this point, honestly, I don't carry cash. I'm... Yeah. I'm cashless right now. I'm commando <laughs> when it comes <laughs> when, it, when it comes to cash. I, I go go, commando. I don't know when I saw but, cash like, like a lot of it. It's just alarming that you you can't trust the system mm -hmm. and say okay, I'm going to go from here to there without any yeah. cash. Not so I mean not too long ago we're talking about we're talking about how these new guys on the finance mm. block are literally PSBs. the ones see, and some 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 marketers and some, they will not even accept any other, but they'll tell you, oh, if it's not this one, don't worry, just okay. go and look for POS or something, mm -hmm. yeah, do you understand? Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, I, I think it's quite, it's, it's quite sad if, if, if the institutions probably that are meant to be the major guys in these fields are not even delivering as yeah. good as... Yeah. But now are. those mobile money operators yeah. seem to be running things because of yes. how speedily yeah. you get to see those Before alerts. you even leave the pim pim. Before you even say pim -pim. Jack Robinson, the alert has, you know, so it's making a lot of uh, business owners a little more confident. Mm -hmm. um, you but know. at the same time, if they lock you out of that app, hey! <laughs> just know that that's don't forget easy. your password. <laughs> Listen, tell us what your experience is. You might want to use the hashtag Wake Up Niger on TVC. And also, do remember now that we're live on YouTube as this moment, as at this moment, and yeah. also on X. Yeah. So you can make comments on there. We're going to read them and we are going to respond to you. Thank you very much. Be careful out there if you're making those transfers. Make sure that it's proper before you get out. Yes, Especially sir. if you're in Idumata. Yeah. Uh, more, careful. Just be prayerful. <laughs> we'll be back. Stay tuned. <laughs>